What's up guys, my name is The Gaming, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get mods in Planet Coaster. The first thing you'll want to do to get mods in Planet Coaster is download this file right here. Once it is downloaded, it will then come up here and you want to click here and it will take you to your folder. Once you are in your downloads folder, it will then turn up here, PC Mod Manager. You then want to hit Extract All and do File Location to Extract. Make sure you remember that location. I created a folder in my Downloads folder and extracted it in there so I don't have to search for the file. Here it is. Once that is downloaded, you'll then be greeted with the extracted version of PC Mod Manager. The next thing we're going to need to do is then go to www.nexusmods.com. There are all of these links will be in the description of this video then what you need to do is you need to go here and manually download this mod make sure you are signed in it will ask you to sign in then you want to hit slow download and it will start downloading again that will come up here on my web browser it does and you'll see it's called realism overhaul mod and you'll click there and it'll take you to where it was downloaded. Make sure you download this one, the No Track Limits version 3 Realism Overhaul. Once that one is downloaded, it will then also show up here. Extract that one into the same folder. Right click and then extract all. You will see that one is there. Then this one is here. Then you want to go in here and scroll down to see this application. Open the application. Once you open the application, you will want to get this mod and chuck it into the PC Mod Manager and then you are done. That is how you add mods to Planet Co. Right guys, so the next thing you are going to want to do is go to your Steam library, find Planet Coaster, then hit the settings icon. Then go manage and browse local game files. When that comes up, you will get this. Now, when you start up the mod manager, it will ask for a directory. You will want to place it in here. This is your directory. Yours will be different to mine, so you need to find it that way. You will then click here and this is your directory. 